Hello and welcome to a bright and sunny County Ground in Letchworth for Hertfordshire FA's Under-13 Cup Final. In a competition that started with 100 teams, now sees Harvesters North take on Sun Sports Youth Yellows in the final. The Hamsters arrive in the final having scored an impressive 40 goals and only conceding 5. They started off with a 14-1 demolition of Ware Rangers Flamingo before a 5-0 defeat of Potters Bar United Youth in the second round. The third round victory at Park Street Road red by 8 goals to 1 was followed by another trip, this time to AC Finchley North, scoring 4 without conceding in the quarter-final. They defeated Warmer Youth Reds by 5 goals to 2 before easing past Royston Town Eagles by 4 goals to 1 in the semi-final. Meanwhile, the Sun themselves have enjoyed a lucrative cup run, netting 36 times and keeping 4 clean sheets. 13-0 win at Bedwell Rangers Lions, followed by a 5-2 home win against Stephen Edgeborough Junior Black Sox. In the third round, they beat Sun Sports Blue by 11 goals to nil before travelling to Watford Sports Red and winning by 2 goals to nil. In the quarter-final, it was another home victory by 2 goals to nil against Ashwell Acad Academicals before a th close 3-2 win at Cheshire Blacks made sure that they arrived in this final. With both sides lethal in front of goal, this final will be won by the defence who manages to keep the opposition quieter. And with the temperature rising, could the conditions play a factor? Lucky to lose control of that ball spread over the top. It's Rodriguez in behind the defence. He's onside here. Into the area. Strong run by Rodriguez. He's got two in the area. Plays it across the field. And it's a goal. Within, the, within 30 seconds of the final. I think it's number 10, Jack McShane. Running, uh, running in at the back post. That's what a ball over the top. To find Rodriguez. Rodriguez strong run into the area. The ball played across. And struck into the back of the net. Uh, fantastic start here for... The Harvesters play through to Rodriguez. We've got Machine with him. Plays it through to the strike pattern. Machine against Quinn. Machine has a shot, but Quinn with a block. Forced to Stacey. Has a shot first time. It's just just off target that time, but Harvesters once again showing the danger from a counter attacking up. Between them, they get the ball clear to Wilson. That's a strong challenge there by James. Machine back to Draper. Plays it in first time, looking for Rodriguez, who does well to come across and get that one. Walsh plays it across, so Stacey was over his head, still under control, Stacey has a shot at goal, doubles, the Harvesters lead in the 23rd minute. Benny Stacey got control of the ball in, in the penalty area, flicked it over his head, and they manage to score his sixth goal of this cup competition, and in the tw 23 minutes, it's now Harvesters nil, uh, Harvesters two, Sun Sports nil. Big plays it in behind. Looking for Walsh. Walsh gets there first. Plays it a shot in. First goal and just wide of the target. Timber playing it in behind. Looking for Wilson. James does well. And then Wilson regains the ball for Sun Sport. Wilson into the area. Four to aim for. Plays it across. Just wide of the target. Ball fell to Leo Chapin, just unable to keep his shot on target, but Stansport once again showing what they can do. Cleared up to McShane, we've got time to turn, looking to play it in behind for Rodriguez. Rodriguez through on this, Rodriguez hopping, and a bit of pressure, and but then manages to slot it in behind, hopping, and makes it 3-0 to the harvester. Rodriguez just back on after that water break, ball played through in behind him, in behind the defence. And Rodriguez then made no mistake of scoring. Rodriguez, nice bit of skill there, bringing in the control, is cleared. Only to McShane though. Ball out to Willing, plays it back in first time. Rodriguez has a shot from, and it's gone in the back of the net. In the, in the 66th minute of this final, Corey Rodriguez gets his second, his ninth of this cup campaign. Machine. Played it over the top for Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Played it across the stage. He has a shot and makes that. So it makes it 5 0. To the harvesters. Nice link of play between the three goals. Goes Machine. Find Rodriguez. Rodriguez. Instead of going for his hat, he played it through. To Benny Stacey's teammates, which gets his second of the afternoon and seventh of the cup. 
Scored another half, it's five. And that's it, the referee blows, full time whistle. Harvesters won the end of the Athletes Cup final by five goals. The first half goals from Jack McShane and, and Benny Stacey gave him a 2-0 half time lead. Before Cody Rodriguez scored two goals in the second half and then with minutes to go at the end of the match, Benny Stacey get, getting his second of the match full time score here at the Counter Garden Leicester. The Harvesters, five, Sunsports Yellow, nil.